Hey guys, welcome to Draco Ray Gaming. I'm Draco, and today we're going to be talking about Streamlabs overlays, overlays in general, some overlays, packages, things. What is an overlay? What? Where do you get them? What, what are the animated paid versus free overlays? How do you install them? We're going to be talking about all these different kinds of things today. I'm going to bring it right to you immediately. No BS as usual. This is Draco. Let's go. All right. What is an overlay? Uh, it's something in Streamlabs or OBS or whatever you're using, XSplit, whatever, that gives you a layout. Uh, you can see a lot of these different layouts. What's a layout? Well, it's when you're transitioning from so you're starting of the stream to your be right back screen to this to that. So for instance, in the Synthwave pack here, uh, you have the starting screen, you have your intermission screen with your camera, your chat box and gameplay. You can put your social down here, point them to your other social media platforms, let people know when you're offline, have your offline thing on Twitch or Mixer or wherever, letting people know when you're be right back and you can have these scene switches uh, and, and add these nice smooth transitions to make your stream flawless and have some structure to your stream, not just an instant go live, right? Right when you want your camp, you want your stream to go live, you don't always want to be right on camera. Maybe you want to just say, hey, the stream's starting soon. I'm fixing a couple things, you're doing things, you're letting people flood into the stream, and then you go to your you go to your actual game screen or whatnot. And so these this is actually a streamlabs.com slash library, which they have quite a bit of different ones and they break them out into widget themes and scene themes and we don't need to really get into that too much. All you really need to know is that there's some paid ones and there's some non-paid ones. So we've talked about what an overlay is, where you get them, and now we're kind of talking about the paid versus free ones. So obviously the paid ones are awesome. They're animated, kind of like the one I was showing you. They, they move, they do things, right? Um, they have uh, better graphics, uh, they, they come with new follower alerts, new donation alerts. It's almost like a full quality package so that you can do whatever you want to do with your overlay, make your stream look awesome, yada, 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 yada. So how do you get them? Well, I mean, basically you just click install here on the website and you can grab them. I don't want to, let's grab a free one and just install it right now in my live OBS that I'm using to record this. All right, I typed free in there and free is what you want to do so you can find just the free ones it looks like they're tagged free so this looks like a Fortnite one this looks like whatever one so let's just pick one let's just pick like I don't know let's just pick this one and what we want to do is click install uh, it's gonna ask me what application I want to install this this pack to and we're gonna say yeah I'll install it to my Streamlabs so you can actually go into Streamlabs itself if you don't want to go off the website and look at them, you can go here into themes, go to scene themes, go to install overlay and actually install it directly from here. So what I've done is I finished going to themes and installing it. It's installed now. Uh, and what's going to happen is it's going to show up as circuit breaker, the pack, the same name inside of here. And you can see all your different scenes, your package, your scene overlay packages in here that you can switch to and actually mess around with it. Uh, once you open the circuit breaker pack, what you're going to see is all these different scenes here, like I like I have here. So I can show you some different things that I have with mine, right? Like if I go to full camera view, it'll switch. I have I have different scene transitions that change the layout and do these kind of things. And when I switch back to my game mode, I have an intro like this. It switches back over to me and then I have a full screen view of my camera and over my game and my camera down here in the corner. And that's kind of how you get the package installed. That's how you kind of switch between the scenes and you start using them and adding your own different elements here, like your webcam in that scene, your sounds and things like that. That's the basics of how it works. Um, if you want to use multiple overlays, install multiple overlays and packages. Try different ones. They'll all be here and you can switch between them. I don't want to do it right now because it'll cut my, my sources and my microphone here live in Streamlabs. But that's essentially what you do. How, that's how it works. And uh, you can start laying out all these different overlays and things and packages and setting up some structure to your streams and scenes. A lot of people just don't go over the basics on how you do this and how you use it. So I really wanted to just take some time to show people just starting out that weren't sure what to do on how to get them, how to install them, and just kind of what they are. So I appreciate, uh, as always, anybody who likes, comments, subscribes. I appreciate it. I'm here to just do some weekly videos and help the gaming community out and share some knowledge that I have. This was a very basic, simple video, but I just, I tend to not see these type of videos out there uh, that are they're straight to the point and really kind of helping out the beginning people, kids and everybody just trying to 
uh, learn how that get started with streaming. I mean, most people don't even know that you can go right into Streamlabs uh, themes and get them there, or go to the website itself and look at these, type in free, and get some free overlays to start with. Um, and as well, you can get overlays a lot of different places, uh, different websites um, out there. Just search, um, you know, uh, stream overlays, and you can find a lot of different ones. Even like the one I'm using right now, I bought from a different third-party website that builds these kind of packages, and it wasn't directly through Streamlabs. So again, I appreciate everybody stopping by and watching these videos. Please like, comment, and subscribe. This is Draco Ray Gaming. Well, now I'm on